today's video is a plan with me in my Hobonichi weeks. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is another plan with me in my Hobonichi weeks, just like the last video that I showed you. I'm gonna be filming my plan with me for my weekly pages using this kit called Happy Animals. It is part of our cute line. We also have stickers that are Happy Animals for the calendar. No, not the calendar, but the monthly pages. So here are the other kits that are good for the weekly pages. They are very chic, very pretty. But we are going to be using the cute one today. So let's start with a clean page and I'm going to go ahead and put down my date cover-ups. This is something that hadn't changed from the last format of my weeks. As well as the bottom bar stickers, the right and the left. So my plan for the new format is to make sure that it is staying true to functional planning with a decorative twist here and there. That's why I added that long sidebar. So this sidebar can be used as a checklist. And as you will see later, I use it for my tracker. This is also my social media planner and my decorative or designing Hobonichi weeks. That's why it still shows May, but I'm going to use it for June. So if you have Hobonichi weeks lying around that are from 2017 and you want to use it again, you can go ahead and grab our weekly kits and you can just cover up the, the dates and use it once again. So I'm putting down my weekend banner as well as a few decos. That is one of the very big changes in the kit. I have removed a lot of the decos and instead put down a lot of these labels or header stickers that you can use on the right or left page. But what I'm doing is that I'm using it on the left page to mark down priorities. You get a lot of them, so you can actually put down two for one, um, one day of the week, for each day of the week. You can also just use the dots. As you can see here on Wednesday, I'm just putting down the dots because that is not a social media day. It is the first day of class, so I will be busy. But for the rest of the week, I'm going to go ahead and um, put down some things that I need to do for social media, particularly YouTube. I want to film and edit. I've already filmed it. I feel very productive, but I need to edit and voice over a lot of my videos. So here I'm using that sidebar as a tracker. That's why I put track on there. And then for the left page, those are going to be my to-dos or rather my priorities for the day. But I'm also putting down goals on the right page. These are going to be my goals for the week. So social media goals for the week. And for other to-dos, I'm just going to write that down on the right page, on that blank space there. When I was designing this kit, I wanted you guys to have the option of writing down on the actual paper some more instead of just pulling it up with all sorts of stickers. And basically, we are done with the kit. Now I pulled some of my decorative sheets from different shops. These are gifts from two different people, Anina Fish as well as Soak Artisan Soap. These are my friends. Soak Artisan Soap sells um, handmade soaps and then Anina Fish has um, a shop that she sells her embroideries. I have one bag from her. It is so pretty. It's one of my favorites. So I'm just writing down my uh, dates for June 4 through 10 and then on Saturday it's a big day because it is new releases day and I'm very happy that I got that sheet of the Kiki K stickers it's my very first one and it actually matches the blue of the kit 
so very happy about that I'm also using a lot of the cat stickers because I am a cat person and look at how cute those cats are too cute too cute to use even but I have to I want to use up all my stickers and I want to not have stickers just to collect just to hoard I'm trying to be very good at that for Sundays Sunday is a huge filming day for me because what I plan to do is to film everything in one go and then edit it through the week because I do have a lot of things to do as we are going to release weekly now instead of bi-monthly so we have four releases and I need the time to design the kits so Wednesday is a big school day that's why I don't have anything to do on that day but Mondays and Monday and Tuesday will be big filming days so that I'm ready for the rest of the week I'm actually editing this on the Monday <laughs> and I filmed this on Sunday so yesterday So here you can see how to how I make um, or choose my priorities. It's just forcing me to make sure that if I only have not such a long time to dedicate to videos, then I need to prioritize what I need to do. As for trackers, these are little things that I need to do for social media like IG posts, blogs, etc. Now for goals, I'm going to go ahead and decorate that bit on the side covering up that number because we don't need that number, that is the wrong one. This format also makes me prioritize my weekly goals, makes me write it down so that I can see it and I can have a more productive week. Now for the bottom of the page, after my to-dos, I keep that clear so that I can write down things that I that happens in the week that I need to do for next week. And then last decorative sticker down, and we are done! Yay! Look at that cover! So pretty! Thank you so much for watching guys! Welcome back to my channel by the way. I'm sorry for not posting for a month apparently. But if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want some more planning videos, please subscribe and hit that notification bell so you're notified whenever I post new videos. Visit paperjoyph.com for more sticker goodies for Hobonichi and other planners. You have a good one.